Well, it's still a blizzard outside, or almost, uh, on and off. You never know what to expect with the weather these days, but in here, it's hot as always. Yeah. Once again, I'm Ian Drew, senior editor here at Us Weekly Magazine, with this week's very special guest, Kimberly Caldwell, formerly of American Idol, host of TV Guide, girlfriend to many, with an album out on <laughs> August 6th. <laughs> We've followed your romantic exploits over the years. Yes, in this very uh, I've heard. So, I've heard. Yeah. Uh, but today we are going to talk about other people, and you're going to help me out. I love that. And uh, these are, as always, the top five sizzling stories from our new issue here on usmagazine.com. First up, Tiger Woods and Elon, they will stay together. Yes, everyone is wondering what will happen to these two after he's getting out of rehab for sex addiction therapy. She was spotted with him. Well, a source close to her actually informs us that she will give it another go. She wants to help him through everything and they want to try to work things out. Meanwhile, another source says that her twin sister is wary and says that she's afraid Tiger will cheat again. So we don't really know, but uh, it's nice to see for the children's sake anyway, maybe right. that they're <clears throat> trying to keep things together. Well, are we sure that he's not actually cheating with the twin sister? Was it really Elin that picked up Tiger from the sex rehab list? I didn't even know she had a twin sister. Kate Goslin. she was out out last week at Butter in New York with her hairstylist. She chopped off some of her $7,000 hair extension, so she had a sexy new look. And when a sexy new guy, a hot young guy, walked by the table, she was saying, he's hot. <gasps> is that you? Kate actually is not ready, though, to move on quite yet. Mm. Don't get too excited. Okay. Uh, the hairstylist, Ted Gibson, told us that she's in an experimental phase of her life, but not quite ready to move on with a hot young stallion quite yet. Right. So, well, I thought that we were leaving the uh, partying and abandoning the kids to John. Well, the Super Bowl was not just about the actual players, and it wasn't just about Kim Kardashian versus Kendra and what's right. going on there. It was actually about people coming together. And Kristen Cavallari was the latest. She also knows quite a bit about hooking up. This time she was spotted getting very cozy with the NFL's Mark Sanchez after the Maxim party. They were also spotted leaving together. And sources are abuzz that they are in couplehood. So, or just boning. Or just boning, which maybe, I don't know, can you fill us in what these rumors are like? Are they often true? Are they not true? You know, it just depends on which rumor it is. But if it's Kristen Cavallari, it's probably true. Probably. And in other hookup news, Rihanna and Matt Kemp, you know, they had that steamy trip to Mexico. On the yachts. Uh, yes, okay. and they were all over each other. Well, after the Grammys, they went with J&B, her BFF, to Guys and Dolls in LA, where Matt was spotted giving his number to another girl via a friend, and he was not looking close with Rihanna. They were seated separately, not really hanging out. We checked in, meanwhile, with a Rihanna source who informed us that it was really just a sex thing. It was not really, you know, once again, headed just to the altar. Yeah, exactly. So she can take some cues from Kristen, well, whoever that is as well. <laughs> Regardless <laughs> of what went down this year at, after the Grammys, we definitely know that it was better than last year for her. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So she's hot, she's smoking, girls want to be her, guys want to do her, so yeah. go Rihanna. And finally, Luke Wilson. Yes, he's on all those mm. cell phone ads, but I bet you forgot that he's actually dating someone. Yes. Who? It's a Simpson. Not Jessica, not Ashley. Don't worry, rest, rest. Lisa. <laughs> Marge. <laughs> no. No, Meg Simpson. <laughs> Who is that? At the 2010 Northern Trust Open, a golf tournament in LA, yes. they were spotted together. You could see a picture if you want to see what she looks like. We might not know much more about her, but you could see that picture in this week's VIP scene. Needless to say, though, that's all the time we unfortunately have left for this week. It was so much fun having you I here. I know, you're awesome. Yes, you too. Stop talking about me. I did, no, do talk about I did already. Her song is on my blog, Ian and Your Ear, here on usmagazine.com, as well as more stories from this week's issue. So you can check us out there. And anything left, check out in our new issue on yes. Who Stands Now. Go get it. And, oh, and go get my album, April 6th. It's called Without Regret. Shame.